Ugh, I hate stairs. Oh my god! You hate stuff too? Sure. Never really thought about it, but yeah, I hate things. I hate those stairs. I know! I hate that bridge. It's so stupid! I hate- I will. What now? Ugh. I don't think this is gonna work out. Hey, what's up everybody? It's Jeff from Achievement Hunter, and welcome to Awu. Number 83. It's my front yard. Deal with it. For the week of October 10th, 2011. 10, 10, 11. Did anybody do anything crazy this week? I haven't looked at them yet. Wow, that was insane! <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, so, uh, this is the part where I tell you about all the new games that are coming out and whatnot, and there are a bunch. It is a Connect shovelware explosion this week. A little grunty there. <sighs> okay, so, uh, first and foremost, Forza Motorsport 4, which if you're one of those dudes that or dude ladies that like simulated sports games, sports dude, dude ladies, simulated driving games like uh, Forza or uh, the PlayStation version. What is it called? The PlayStation one is uh, with the clown, Twisted Metal. <laughs> Speaking of Gran Turismo, of course. So that game's out, and Forza's supposed to be pretty good. I know that we'll do some videos in it for Achievement Hunter, so woohoo! Also this week, uh, I guess the big like, hey, kind of title is uh, Dead Rising 2 off the record, we'll which is, this. hey, <laughs> which is Dead Rising 2, but with Frank West, who I guess was more popular than Chuck. Got a, uh, this is not our achievement of the week, but it's got a uh, achievement to uh, kill 100,000 zombies. <sighs> that is a fucking trend. That is a fucking trend that I wish would end soon. Also coming out this week, Wipeout 2. You can look like a jackass in your living room. It'll be great. Ace Combat Assault Horizon. Is Ace Combat one of those franchises that puts out a game every two weeks? I feel like I've said Ace Combat something at least 10 times this year. Hulk Hogan's main event. I was gonna do like a Hulk Hogan impression, but I don't know the energy. Sesame Street, Once Upon a Monster, which I'm actually pretty excited about. That's a double fine game. And as you know, Double Fine only makes really awesome and interesting and innovative games with unique gameplay. It sounded like an advertisement for <laughs> yeah. Double Fine. Uh, also, Red Dead Redemption Game of the Year Edition. If you're one of the uh, four people who has an Xbox 360 and didn't play Red Dead last year, then uh, it's Game of the Year Edition. I'm assuming it probably comes with a bunch of the DLC. Those are my notes. <laughs> Michael Phelps, push the limit! I've always wanted to connect swim and now I have the opportunity I'm gonna be just like Michael Phelps and then maybe there'll be rumors that I banged Demi more too isn't it it's on the it's on the box right requirements yeah. connect <laughs> joint <laughs> connectimals now with bears because that's what was missing from that game bears and then on the uh, deal nope arcade front we've got a uh, dual threat of guardian heroes and real steel and on DLC there's a lot of DLC this week it's a lot of everything this week insanely twisted shadow planet which is just hard to say has their shadow hunters DLC crimson alliance has their Vengeance pack, which I know we're going to be covering. And Dragon Age 2 has Mark of the Assassin, which I think we'll be covering as well. Uh, I should probably pick the game of the... Or the game of the... I should probably pick the Achievement of the Week now, so let's do that. I am going to buck convention and not do it in Dead Rising, even though that's the big game of the week. I'm going to do it in Hulk Hogan's main event. I'm going to pick getting a sandwich, be right back, which is to, uh, <laughs> that's the achievement. It's actually getting a sandwich, comma, BRB. And the uh, criteria for that achievement is uh, for the player to leave the sensor area in the middle of a stunt. The title is a lot funnier than the description. I should also mention, we're doing a, a special thing on Achievement Hunter this week. That is uh, who we've decided. You know, we've been doing AH Predicts for a while, where every week we pick a, a big whatever popular sport it is this season it's football it's what the kids are playing and we predict to see who's gonna win we're four and two right now by the way jack and uh so in addition to that i decided to make a series a seven part series to determine who the best nba team of all time is so if you're like me and kind of wondered that enough to let the game play itself then uh tune into achievement hunter today actually the first one should be up it's the uh 1997-98 chicago bulls versus the 1970-1971 milwaukee bucks so it's the 90s bald heads versus the 70s afros who will win? Also, watch Game Fails. <laughs> Seriously, watch the shit out of that. YouTube.com slash Game Fails. I think there's a charity as well. Jack will tell you about that. Video games. I just realized Jeff's stuff was really, really bright. Yeah, so the charity event that Jeff was mentioning is actually called Extra Life. Uh, we actually ran it last year, and uh, this year we're going to have Fragger, who's going to be running it for us. So uh, check out more information on the site for it. Donate some money to charity. It's always for a good cause, and, uh, you know, show that gamers aren't bad people. So as far as news goes this week, not a whole lot going on, but I figured I'd tell you some stuff anyway. So uh, remember when I mentioned that Netflix was splitting up into two companies? One was going to be called Quickster and then Netflix was going to be streaming stuff. Yeah, it's not happening anymore. So uh, Netflix announced, uh, I guess this past weekend, that they're actually not going to be splitting up the company anymore. Quickster has already ceased to exist before we even knew ye. Also announced uh, this past week, 
Uh, this makes me sad. So uh, Zynga, the guys who make Farmville, have said that uh, they're working possibly on a movie. Well, they haven't said that. They've hinted at it. So there might be a Farmville movie. That sounds terrible. I wonder if it's just like, you know, two hours of people building farm. I don't know. I've never played Farmville. I guess people still play it, right? Your mom plays it, probably. And last but not least, uh, I know we just missed it on Awu last week, but the iPhone 4S was announced, which is the uh, brand newest iPhone coming out from Apple. And it's going to be crazy fast, and it's got an extra camera on it, and I'm sure there's going to be a lot of games that implement stuff on the iPhone 4 that we haven't had anything else so it's gonna be very very cool I know I pre-ordered one boom mic that's a boom mic ow ow your, your mic is boomed. So, anyway, iPhone 4S is coming out this Friday. If you, you want to go wait in line, you can grab one, or you can order one from Apple or the AT&T store. I recommend ordering from Apple, because if you go to the AT&T store, you're going to have to wait like a month and a half. They didn't bother telling me that, and I ordered it. Whatever. First world problems. Here. Except that I have cake. That's tea. okay. Talk. Talk. What are you doing? I don't know. You're ramming into me. So I'm putting out a video today that um, Marshall helped me with, as well as the beautiful Martha Marin. Uh, and Jeff helped a lot, too. So hopefully you'll like it. Let me know what you think. Special appearance by Griffin. All right. So that does it for the week. And uh, yeah, we'll see you uh, doing stuff on the internets. All right. Bye. <laughs>